like this is like next level stuff really from what i understand if i put an intercooler on the car did you not see that that is mad that is a madness bro so if we put stage three intercooler on we'll put the injectors in because i imagine that probably changes something no uh, we probably can't see that oh, hey look at this look at this i'm a proper tuner now lads i don't know what i'm doing Basically, we've just remapped the thing. I'm going to take this thing for a rip, lads. What are we thinking? We're going to put the road dyno on. What are your predictions on horsepower? Right. Well, obviously, we're proper tuners now, isn't it? I have no I idea what is going to happen to the little Civic. <laughs> oh, my God. I've got a misfire already, and I'm not even driving, bro. Uh, it tastes tuning. Come on. It's a little bit rich, I think. I think that's what the problem is. Alright, lads, 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 we've just actually tuned a car in a Sato Corsa for the first time. This is just for one car? Yeah. Right. But there's multiple cars. And there's multiple cars that work with it, but it's just a little bit bit awkward at the minute to get it all going and stuff. Right? So, for like the tenth time, if you haven't used this before, uh, it's ECU tuner. Most in-depth thing I've seen on a Sato Corsa. You've got its fuel ratio maps. I've got nothing... I don't know what this is. This is injection, open time correction map. I don't even know what that means. Timing map, ignition timing map. I've got some idea of what that means, but I need to have a play around with everything. Wastegate spring. So as you just saw, the engine actually changed. So I'll show you that again. If you add an intercooler and we go stage three, changes and adds an intercooler. I don't know how I adopt this from killing me. Is it load preset? Beneath the load preset, there's, there's normal boost and over boost. Yeah. Click on one of them, click load preset, and it'll load one of them, and then work off that. Over boost, bro. Come on. Wait, right, I'm going over boost, bro. Are you mad? I'm turning the thing up. How do I turn it up even more? Look. Boom. Boom. Yeah? We're gonna rip it up. Wait, right, no misfire! No fish! No misfire, but 600 degrees, the fan's coming on again. We're gonna spin it, lads. We're trying to boost, we're trying to make the fastest boosted Civic ever, but I don't, I think there's a boost control. Yeah, so what happens if we just change this to like 100 and bring it in like there? Three and a half K, 65. Oh, yeah, watch, 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 watch. Solenoid must just mean turn it up, innit? Basically, when I see solenoid, I just think. The higher the number, more solenoids, so more boost. Jeez, boosting at eight. Hey, right, can you hear both fans? 700 degrees. All right, let's try launch control then. No, 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 no. Did you man just... Did we hear the same game? Oh, hey, bro, this is mad. Oh, misfire. The fans are coming again. Yeah, I don't think we can go crazy on boost levels. What should we use now? Should we bang the R8 on? downloaded a couple but please if this works with the engine bay it is a very long day the cooler stage three did that change anything no injectors stage three wastegate spring 15 psi yeah so i don't think we get all the all the fun and get to see it but yeah something else cool on this mod is when you use extra option extra option one change the dash um because obviously on the real car you have multiple views um on the dashboard so you can have this view or you can have this view and then on there you can have your normal android screen from a Sato, or you can have the g80 one i thought it was pretty cool so we made 617 wheel horsepower in third gear if we go to fourth gear i'll we'll get it rolling in fourth gear Yeah, so it's like 600 brake, basically. Both fans are coming on. EGT's going up to 800.
The exhaust is getting too hot, guys. Let's see what happens to the car. While the fans are going off, we're going to send it round the roundabout. And we've misfired. The fans are just blowing in my ear rolls off. Uh, should we do Nissan GTR next? Can we open the bonnet on this? No. Okay. ECU tuner. Over boost. Uh, listen, I've learned my lesson. Diagnostic port. Bro, you can do diagnostics. This is so in-depth. This is the most in-depth thing ever. Each code will be a two-digit digit number represented by a series of five-second flashes for the numbers and a gap of 1.5 seconds between digits. Between each code is a 2.5-second pause. In example, code 14, then 21 would be one 0.5-second flash, then one 1.5-second pause, then four. All right, that is a mad thing. You lot are acting like Morse code. We're all going to be speaking in diagnostic ports soon. Right, overboost. Doesn't even work on the GTR, mate. Oh, we were in diagnostic mode. Sorry, lads. Oh, another car with a misfire. All I do is tune cars and give them misfires. Right. I'm going to get to the bottom of this. I'm going to actually get to the bottom of this. It's probably not as compatible with certain cars and more compatible with other cars. I can see what this being an absolute pain in the ass, but the fact that this is even in the game is crazy. I'm just maxing out the boost. I don't know what I'm maxing out, but we're maxing it out, lads. Lads, I'm no tuner. Can someone comment? Or, or Well, this will be a YouTube video, so can someone comment? Because we've got no boost at the minute. And we can actually go on a real dyno. We don't need the road dyno. Go the real thing, lads. Yeah, we're rolling. Hey, we're rolling, lads. I've never actually been able to roll, but we're not even in the rollers. There we go. Hey, we're trapped. We're trapped. We're trapped. We're falling off the dyno. But yeah, on that note, guys, I'll be live again playing some Pudsy and some UK street racing and stuff. Um, stay tuned. We will be doing some giveaways over the Christmas period as well. Um, but that will be more with the events that are to come from all the Christmas stuff anyway, like the snow map, etc. We're going to do some snow drifting and things like that. So plenty of stuff to get tucked in with uh, over the Christmas period. So if anyone needs anything, just drop us a message. Um, but yeah, I'm going to call it. Hope you have a good rest of your weekend, like I say. Take it easy.